and a rash of close calls in West Lynn. Witnesses say kids riding motorized, motorized pocket bikes, scooters, and also dirt bikes are using the sidewalks and streets, nearly hitting people. Hey, does Margie Lynch talk to neighbors and police who want to warn these riders, Margie? Well, they do. Steve and Deb, they say there have been way too many near misses with dirt bikes and people in the past few weeks, and someone's bound to be hit. They saw me running, and I was telling them, I'm going to call the police. You need to stop. Maria Radcliffe was terrified. I was screaming super loud, and they didn't even hear me. Her two young kids in a box of sidewalk chalk just outside her Westland home and suddenly in the path of two dirt bikes. I could hear the sound and I realized what was happening and I was screaming at them, but they're trying to, they didn't even hear me screaming because the bikes were so noisy. She barely had time to move her kids, called police and found out she's not the only one. They have had like 15 calls, they said, and they said, you know, they're so frustrated because they can't find them. They're ripping through those to get to these. In fact, Westland police say they've had a real problem since the start of summer break. Just in the last couple of weeks, we've had several calls already. See, like once school's gotten out, we're seeing younger kids now are taking these out. Maybe they're doing it when mom and dad are at work. Problems off Parker Road near Willamette Falls Drive and calls going out across town and tickets, too. I pulled a kid over a couple weeks ago, uh, about a month ago, out on Dollar Street out in the Willamette neighborhood. He was just ripping down Dollar Street on a dirt bike, no helmet. As neighbors share their horror stories. Kids were playing up here, terrified me. They were going 30 miles an hour or so up and down the streets. They fear it's a problem that will only get worse with someone hurt. And what kids do, they don't know, they hear, should I, should I go this way, what do I do? You know, they could jump right in the line of the bike. And she said she's seen those bikes back a couple times in her neighborhood. But police say they're carrying a chart so they know what all of these bikes, what's legal, what's not. And they say kids can't ride them on the streets and they can expect to pay a fine. You guys are both parents. Don't you think parents must know which kids have which bikes? And Maybe think they're all...